Buckskin. I'm uh, from Adelaide, South Australia. I'm a Ghana and Naranga person, so our uh, big lit butterfish mob is uh, my mob. <laughs> our fish over there, our local fish, our totem fish, got big lips, same as us mob. <laughs> it's like how we point, we point with our lips, so it helps. Big lips. <laughs> if you don't know, buckskin is a uh, colour of a horse, it's a lightly tanned horse with dark hair. So not only am I horse by name, I'm horse by nature. <laughs> we run fast, you mob. Yeah, you sick mob, yeah? I know what you're thinking. But um, I married a Vietnamese woman. And uh, my kids, got two kids, a son and a daughter. My daughter's Malia. My son, Vincent. And um, they're buckskins as well. And I thought, um, my son looks very much like his grandfather. So I thought, why not uh, shorten his name, make it sound more Asian? So I call him Vin. Vin Buck. <laughs> my daughter's Malia, so I call her Ma. Ma Buck. Vin Buck and Ma Buck. <laughs> my two kids. The only two kids that run around and they're probably the only young Vietnamese who's going around. <laughs> Talking about my father-in-law. and uh, He's a bit of a character, Vietnamese fella. Real strong Vietnamese fella. He come around for dinner one night and he starts telling the kids to yarn, you know, and as we're having dinner, we have KFC for dinner. Love KFC. <laughs> So he comes around and he starts clapping. My daughter goes, Granddad, why you only got half a finger? He goes, I cut it off. What you cut it off for? I thought it was funny. <laughs> What'd you do with it? I ate it. I was like, hey, hey, hey. Don't go telling my kids that. We already got this idea you fellas eat everything. Fingers and all. So we're having KFC, you know, and I had to watch my kids, you know, because they finger licking good. That's what they say about KFC. You see the kids, they're licking their finger down. Just bite that finger off. Just like your grandfather. But uh, yeah, he's a bit of a character. Enjoy him. But, uh, you know, I was sitting there before coming over to Melbourne. I uh, thought I'd go up to the wife last night and go, you know, how about jumping on the horse and have a couple more kids? She goes, piss off. Go and play with yourself. <laughs> okay. But you know, fellas, we never do it in front of them, even if they tell you to do it. So I waited for her to go to sleep. Sitting there, that breathing getting heavier. I reckon she's asleep, I'm gonna go for it. <laughs> so I did the little triangle in the bed, you know, so then you got a little bit of room between your legs and you can't, you can't hear the quilt going for it then. <laughs> but I couldn't get it done, you know, so I needed a little bit of help, so I pulled the phone out. Red chip. <laughs> I seen one little movement over here, I just. <laughs> <laughs> she's like, you ain't. Uh, leave me alone. Get no sleep. So I didn't, I didn't finish off. She goes, oh, well, I'm going to, um, yeah, I didn't want to wait another half an hour. So I was like, all right, I'll, I'll wait till the morning. And I, was, I went to the shower and finished off. You know, when they, you know, when the fish die and you flush down the toilet, it goes back to the sea. I thought, all right, oh, oh. When you're doing your business and you finish off, it, guess where it goes? It goes down the drain, back to the sea. 
So I thought about it. Huh? We probably got more kids out there than just my two. <laughs> Impregnated a couple of fish out there, maybe. Made some mermaid babies. I was out fishing the other day. Spear fishing. And I'm sitting there swimming around with my spear, and man, goggles on. I started feeling awkward. I was like, all right. I'm gonna um, start all here, turn him, turn him. Started freaking out a little bit. Started thinking about what's going on back home. I was like, oh, yeah, I should be right. Got mermaids looking after me out here. <laughs> and in the distance, all I see is this big thing, big shark. And straight away, I go, hmm, them lips. <laughs> I reckon that's my son. <laughs> Is your name Finbuck? <laughs> Thank you everybody, enjoy the rest of the night.